A warm hello and welcome from our Business Solution Center in Wiesbaden, or more precisely, it's hard, the event hall. My name is Stephanie Hartung and I would like to present both systems to you. A short note for those of you who do not know the Solution Center, we constantly install and demonstrate the latest applications for the end customers here in the event hall. The hall itself has a size of approximately 120 square meters and it's perfect as our test lab, for example, event or lecture hall scenarios. Now let's get to the actual demo. I will start with the so-called audio tracking solution. You will need the following of this, a Panasonic pan tilt zoom or short PTZ camera. It can be any PTZ camera from our current lineup. Each of these cameras can save up to 100 presets and therefore be used very flexibly. You will also need a media control. We use the CP3 series from Crestron, but the new 4 series can of course also be used. The 10 type touch panel from Crestron can now be seen here as the input device, but this is not absolutely necessary. The missing component is the ceiling microphone, in this case the TCC2 from Sennheiser. Of course you can also use the Shure MXA910. As you can see, we have removed the microphone and it hovers approximately 3.8 meters above the ground. Plenty of room volume is still available. With an installation like this, one recognizes the strength of the TCC2 and its exclusion zones in relation to possible reverberation times due to the missing ceiling. The camera we use today is the AWHE38 and transmits the speaker within the hall with a view of the moderator or lecturer. We have defined six zones in advance using the Crestron module. I'm currently in a defined zone. The yellow points to the left of the zone marks whether a sound currently is being detected in it. I'm in zone 5 and as you can see the yellow dot is here as long as I speak. To the left of it there are further zones that you can define in advance via the input mask for each horizontal and vertical solid angle. You can easily do that using the Sennheiser web interface. So now I will move into another zone to better demonstrate the system, just talking would be boring. Uh, so now you can see uh, the new preset uh, of the camera is called by the Crestron module. And just in addition, also again, another zone. And now I'm standing in front of the control panel of the Crestron. And here you can see I can easily adjust uh, the dB value or other settings in the Crestron module. As you can see, the camera is of course not following me live, rather a camera preset is approached accordingly as soon as I arrive in the zone and start talking. The time interval until the camera reacts can also be defined on the touch panel with the controls, just like, for example, the minimum dB value. If several sound sources are detected in the room, the default wide angle preset is used. I can't really demonstrate that on my own, but I'm looking forward to live or remote appointments. Let us now briefly come to our Panasonic auto tracking solution to clarify the difference a little bit. But don't worry, I'll keep it short. Depending on the application, they are the AWSF100 or SF200 software. Using the GPU based software, our current PTZ cameras can follow a speaker live without any additional operator. So it is the live solution for one person. The interface is similar to our free software PTZ control center. Every command that can be seen can be controlled via our API. This means that tracking can also be easily integrated on a touch panel. After the tracking function has been activated, I can move around and the AWUE100 follows me here. As you can see, it doesn't matter if I look into the camera, wear a mask or turn to a blackboard. Through the GPU-based body detection, the speaker is always followed by means of deep learning, which is an algorithm for recognizing image patterns. Another feature is the pan tilt limiter. For data protection in particular, these are important setting options, for example, to omit doors or thus not to violate data protection. Of course, there are other features and setting options available for the tracking system. These can be viewed in the current manual on our past page. Good luck and see you next time.